Hi guys, Jake here from Luxury Visuals. So Massimo asked about how to keep all your assets organized. So if we start building up like a library of chairs, for example, how do we how do we keep all that stuff organized? Because it can be quite hard bringing that stuff in to Max and knowing what's what. Um, so my recommendation is Connector by Design Connected, who also make a lot of 3D models. So you can head over to designconnected.com forward slash connector and go to download and you will need a login but once you're logged in it, that will start downloading so once that's downloaded you can double click on the connector setup and install that just hit next next and install I've already installed it so I'm not going to do that again and once that is installed you'll see it here so it's a separate program you can open that up so what we're going to want to do is add some assets so I'm just going to go into my assets folder and here are a few models that I downloaded off 3D Sky. Um, I'm just going to drag and drop that folder into here. And now we can see when we drop down, them folders are there. So for the first thing, if we click on this lamp, uh, we can see the max file and it's got material in there and it's got some images. So really, these are kind of like filters, so if you click on them, and try and hide them. Now, I still can't tell very much from this thumbnail, so I'm going to click it. I'm going to double click it. And I'm going to hit add more previews, which is in the top left. I don't think it's on your screen. And I'm just going to select these three images, which are the renders of the image. Cool, so we've added them. And whichever one is in first position will be kind of like your first preview. So I'm just going to move to that one. So you can reshuffle them by pulling them around. Now we can close that. So when I click on Floss Lamp, that's the image I see. And if we do the same for the Orchid. So I'm just clicking in the top left. You can't actually see it because it's not in the recording. Um, I'm just going to select these three images. And pipe light as well. Let's double click on that, add some previews, and we'll just add that one. And I'll close that. And now there is an FBX model, this pipe light, but I won't I can't see myself using that, so I'm just gonna delete that. Cool. So we can go through these. Um something else that's quite cool that you should start using these categories. So I'm just gonna put lamps, house plants, oops, and lighting. And I'm just gonna click and drag each one of these into their own one. So now if we have more than one lamp, for example, say say we considered that lighting. So let's delete that category. Now when I'm like looking for a light, I can go in here and I'll be able to see all my models. So how does this work with 3ds Max? We'll go into Max. And now all we've got to do is uh, click drag and drop that lamp in and we're just going to hit merge now we can see we can place this wherever we like in the scene and if you right click you'll stop placing them so you can place more than one um, and that's how we can quickly add assets into our scene and start organizing a lot of our models which when you start building up a big library Design connected is going to be a massive time saver. So we can just put that in there. Really helpful to have an organized library and it will save you a lot of time in the long run. Yes, the setup might take a while, but as I said, in the long run, it's going to save you a lot of time. So I hope this has been useful. 